Dr. Angela Katwa. I work for the Jurassic Coast World Heritage Site and I'm an earth scientist. As an earth scientist, I'm really interested in natural processes um, and natural landforms and how the two connect with each other. I've just been up to Lyme Regis this morning and I've talked to you about what's happening in that town, that process of landsliding which is currently putting areas of the town under threat. What I do in my job is take technical information like that and then convert it into something that members of the public aged from 5 to 65 can understand. So in the example of landsliding, that is a process by which sediment moves under gravity and it reaches a critical angle by which point it starts to settle down and the landslide actually stops moving. If, for example, we then ex impose external controls onto that landslide by, for example, building a car park at the top that's not properly drained, water then flows into the sediment, soaking them up and causing that landslide to be reactivated. So I liken this to coming home from work, you sit on the sofa, you've got your cup of tea and the telly on, and then suddenly the phone rings, it's a telemarketer, and your whole mood is set out of balance, and actually you don't quite feel right after that. That's kind of what happens to natural systems when their equilibriums are put out of balance. And as an earth scientist, I kind of use ideas like that to really get people excited about earth sciences and rocks.